name is Eileen Perez. I'm an astrophysicist, and this is how does weight vary throughout the solar system? So weight has to do with the gravitational field that you're in. So it does depend from, uh, from mass to mass. So it depends on what planet you're on and so forth. So the first thing you need to know is the surface gravity of each planet. The best way to calculate that, so little g is the gravitational constant g times m divided by r. The m is the mass of the planet and r is the radius of the planet. Now on Earth, if you uh, plug in the, you know, the, the constant values, you get that g is equal to 9.8 meters per second square. Now, we have figured out by how much massive each planet is, or for the, radio, the ratio of how, compared to Earth, how strong is the surface gravity of each planet. So Mercury is 0 0.35 g. Venus is 0 0.91 g. Mars is 0 0.39 g, Jupiter is 2.63 g, so as you can tell, now that we're moving towards the outer planets, because of the mass of the outer planets is so much larger, you'll actually end up having a stronger surface gravity because the, the more mass you have, the higher the gravitational force would be. For Saturn is 1.17 g, and then Uranus is 0 0.94 g, and Neptune is 1.06 g. Now let's say that you have somebody who weighs, uh, let's say that has a mass of 55 kilograms. All right, let's figure out what the weight is on Earth. So the weight on Earth, we'll use the equation for weight, which is the mass times the gravitational uh, surface gravity uh, constant, and then that will give you the force of your weight. So this will be 55 kilograms times 9.8, and this is 539 newtons is a force. So weight is actually a force. So now let's see how much we would weigh, let's say, on Mercury. So Mercury is 0 0.35 g. So it would be the weight times uh, 55 kilograms, so we haven't changed a person, times 0 0.35 times g, which is 9.8. And actually this will give you 100 and 83 newtons. So as you can tell, how light you feel from planet to planet may be very di uh, different. So as you can tell, this is 35% lighter than you would feel on Earth. This one is 91% lighter. This one is 39% 30 of the weight on Earth. Jupiter, you will have 263 percent of what you weigh here on Earth and so forth. So as you can tell, you can just plug into your equation the gravitational proportion uh, with G and you can tell how much you would weigh on each planet. My name is Eileen Perez, I'm an astrophysicist, and this is how does your weight vary throughout the solar, uh, throughout the solar system.